you doing, Southern Alberta? This is the Stormbringer bringing you the ECW match of the week on Shaw's television. There I am in the middle. On one side of me, the Duarte, gorgeous Delana. On the other side of me, the 17-year-old missionary, the unbelievably talented, in my mind, in the mind of old-school wrestling announcer, Jay Steele, the next Ricky Steamboat. Six-man tag team action. The team of the Storm Ringer, Delana and Sebastian, versus the Fight Club, Vulture, Adrian Walls, and substituting for MMA athlete, MMA scumbag, I'm just gonna throw that out there, Tom. MMA scumbag, Sky Ace, the cowboy Bryn Watts taking the place of Sky Ace. I guess Sky Ace had a case of diarrhea. Call me crazy, but uh, I think he had the case of the runs running from the bringer, Sebastian and Delana, if you ask me. But that's another story for another, another day. The storm ringer now, outside the ring, Kyle Sebastian in the ring, Delana outside the ring, Adrian Walls and Kyle Sebastian gonna start this contest off. And, Come on, Walls, get in there. I thought you were a tough guy. Ah, Kyle Sebastian offering up myself. You know what, Kyle? It would be my privilege and my honor to go in there and kick the head in with some MMA goon like Adrian Walls. Here we go, the Storm Ringer and Walls. This is what everybody has been anticipating. This is what I've been waiting for. I hate this guy. And he takes in the cowboy. Well, folks, there it is right there. Hey, a picture's worth a thousand words. Adrian Walls takes in the cowboy. My arch nemesis from the last three months, the Cowboy Bryn Watson, the Storm Ringer. Here we go, one more round. Who's gonna get the job done? The big Texas redneck, the angry Cowboy from Oklahoma. Here we go, the crowd is into it, the Storm Ringer is into it. Cowboy's pissed off as always. Here we go, let's lock it up. All right, Cowboy, I'm gonna take your head off, son. One, two, three, let's get the job done. And the Cowboy bails out. Is it just me? Or if we have this match on the air for about two minutes and all I've seen is the MMA goons and the cowboy running. Here we go, finally a lock up. The headlock by the bringer. Beautifully done if I may say so myself. My goodness, I look good sometimes, Tom. Got that headlock locked in, working it, cinching it hard. You know what, folks? I know a lot of people sometimes wonder, when you can get rivals like that, how you can go back to a basic wrestling world. But I'll tell you this, nothing wears a guy down like a headlock. See, there it is, set up, two shoulder taps. Drop down now by the Cowboy. I put on the brakes, lays in the clothesline. Beautifully done. Adrian Walls, you're number one in my books. Cowboy just got your head taken off by the big Texas right now. The snapmare. In comes Sebastian. Setting him up. There we go. You know what? Sebastian and myself have been a tag team for a while. We'll let you refer to ourselves as Dynasty. Myself and the Young Missionary, we're going to be a team for years to come. And if there is ever going to be a team on top of Power Zone Wrestling for the next decade, it is going to be the dynasty of Kyle Sebastian and myself, the Stormbringer. Kyle Sebastian now got Cowboy into the corner, asking the crowd to go quiet. Going to lay it. Now the Cowboy ducks. The Cowboy lays in a big chop of his own. The angry Cowboy from Oklahoma. Beautiful snapmare. Lays in the chin lock. You got it. You know what, folks? I got to laugh at this guy. You ever notice something? The second the cowboy gets the upper hand, he lays in a wicked chin lock. Way to stimulate the audience, cowboy. Way to make them want to see more. Lay in that vigorous chin lock. What an idiot. The arm ringer now, Kyle Sebastian, tags in Walls. Sure, Walls will come in the ring now, but I'm not there. Lays in a stiff right hand. The arm ringer again on Kyle Sebastian. Yeah, taunt me, taunt me, brilliant move, Walls, taunt me. What an absolute idiot. You know what, folks, I, I gotta be honest with you. I'm gonna lay this out there, because I know there's a group of people watching us. They're always watching us. And I'll tell you what, I got respect for what some of these guys do. But idiots like Adrian Walls and Sky Ace, they, they absolutely shred the name of MMA. And there's the tag, and there goes Walls. The Stormbringer's in the ring, and Adrian Walls goes running out of there like a scalded puppy dog. Absolutely revolting. Where's a rear naked chokehold now, Walls? All right, the amateur wrestling champ from England, the Vulture. You know what, Tom? Tom, you and I were talking about Vulture. Tom here, my producer, sit to my left. Tom's always been curious about Vulture. We're actually having a great conversation with the back. Yes, he is the All England lightweight amateur wrestling champion. He is the absolute 
real deal when it comes to wrestling acumen and wrestling ability. Hence his relationship with the Fight Club. Adrian the Wall, Sky is. See, look at the beautiful go behind. Solana just a chance. Ouch! Jesus, bounced her face. What an absolute jerk. Bounced her face off the ring apron. You see that? Unbelievable. Come on, Delana, get up. Delana now making her way to her feet. Volcher now will go behind. You know, is it just me or do we have a, a pretty obvious reason why Walt Volcher went for a go behind? Can you see how he's going to catch like that anywhere else in time? Pulls Delana up. Sets her up against the ropes. Irish whip. Into the Irish whip. And there we go. Beautiful head scissors on Volcher. I don't care if you're an amateur wrestler. You deal with the head scissors of the beautiful Delana. Once again, that's the closest to getting down below. If you know what I mean. But Volcher's probably ever going to get his life. And the tag into the big Texas redneck. Myself, the Stormbringer. Here we go, Vulture. You and me. I don't like this guy. I don't give a crap about your amateur wrestling acumen. I'm going to take you out. Vulture backs me up into the corner. Ah, oh, the irony. Of course. You can see just when I'm about to get the leverage. Just when I'm about to get a little bit of leverage on Vulture. Nails me with the irony. Uh, clubbing blow. Choking me on the top rope. How's that for amateur wrestling? There we go. Choking me on the top rope. They're all proud of their MMA background. They're proud of their amateur wrestling background. But let's choke out the Stormbringer on the top rope. What a bunch of losers. Absolute losers, these guys. My God. Oh. I tell you. I tell you, Tom. Watching this is hard. Watching this is difficult. It's really, really difficult to sit here in this chair and watch scumbag losers like this. Because, you know, it's I'm in the ring to sit here and watch what's happening. Now I know why I'm coughing and hacking up a lung in the ring because these MMA and amateur wrestling losers have my damn throat on the top rope. The cowboy now got me in the corner. Ah, nails the cowboy with the there's that heart of the bringer. And the cowboy comes back for another one. Another kick. The cowboy, he comes, he walks back in. Door! 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 Power Zone Wrestling, February 6th, back at the LCC DA Electric Barn.